there's a big world, and there's so much to explore on planet Earth. One day, you know, we were at the Strand Bookstore downtown, and he's like, oh, you know, do they have any flag books? And they had literally one flag book, and we bought it, and he just started looking at it. As soon as I get home, I start reading it, reading it, reading it, and then eventually I memorize them. I was addicted to looking at that book like every time an hour. It's almost like I'm like a food, I have like a photographic memory. As a young child, I remember that he would quickly memorize the avenues. That was the first thing, like, he would start memorizing. We would just be in his stroller or walking from east to west, and he would, like, know all the avenues. This adorable kid has a unique talent that just might surprise you. Take a look. My name is Peter Schuster Ryberg, and I'm six and a half years old. I can name 250 or more facts. I don't think you'll be able to stop me. I doubt it. Mongolia. What? What? Okay. Mongolia? Okay. okay, all right. Okay, ready? Here's flag number two. Botswana. Botswana. Okay, here's another one. Do you know this one? Austria. Oh my god. We were gonna give you a hint, but clearly you don't. Flag number four. Serena. When I look at flags, I just feel good. Then after I look at like 10 flags, I leave out my sad place and I go do what I want to do again. So flags really help me with my emotions. Do you want to play? <laughs> I like the shapes that really look showed of the history of the country itself. I want to know the past, like, like what it was like before I was alive. I feel like I have an invisible line connected from me, myself, to everybody in the country that I'm looking at. It feels like I have a line tied to, to those people. Most of the time, they represent a lot of stuff or sometimes they can represent what most people do in the city. I came up with my own country called, it has my name in it, Petertopia. Really, you know, it's, it wasn't Saudi Arabia, Zambia, or Iran. Or what? Iran. Iran? No, Oh. Saudi Arabia. Oh. I know that. I know this one, I've heard no one's okay. Uh. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm proud of him like every day because, you know, he's, yeah, he memorizes things and that's like really impressive, but he's also just like a really good person. <laughs> he always wants to know how things work and why and how. I think, you know, with flags comes history. So I think, yeah, it's important to know history of countries. History kind of blends in with flags for me. I feel like it's important that people could know all the flags, like me, so they can know everything about our world, like, and what it represents. <laughs> 